Welcome back, nerds and portal masters. This is the 13th episode of the Skylanders walkthrough series. We're in the Goo Factory. Uh, we just crossed the halfway mark. Um, as you can see, I've got my sunburn out this time around. I don't really care for him because I think his fire range or his fire attack range is very uh, small. But since I have the 300% experience boost, it's kind of nice. Uh, as you can see, the story scroll is not that far away from the beginning, so make sure you're paying attention. Though, not like you could miss the giant freaking spinny scroll thing. But you're going to have a lot of bomb puzzles in this board. Uh, then there's the first treasure chest. Uh, not so much any real big puzzles till we get to the uh, fire gate later in the level, but it's pretty easy. It's just a moving box slider puzzle, so you shouldn't have too much trouble there. got an air gate in this level. I've got a uh, fully upgraded Warnado. Um, he has a decent amount of HP and you're gonna need a lot of HP if you're trying to get through this minefield. I probably should have picked a better one than him uh, for it being that he's so slow but um, maybe somebody like Drill Sergeant or um, maybe uh, Flame Slinger would be a little bit better for this area because uh, you're going to get the hat but you've got all those mines that are in your way, so maybe somebody who's got a little bit more of uh, some hops with them. Uh, and then inside this uh, air portal area, you're going to have the uh, legendary treasure, which is the Troll Stein. And, you know, a nice little beer glass because the game is only made for people who are generally under 21, but whatever. I don't think Activision recognized what they were putting in. Right here we have the Soul Stone for uh, Camo, which allows you to turn his uh, little Sun Orb attack, which is the main attack for him, into armor. Uh, all you have to do is hold down the A button and it'll automatically give you a little bit of armor. But it's unique in that it allows you to heal yourself. It's, I think, 5 HP every three seconds that you have it active with three orbs. So it's a, a nice little way to ensure that your camo stays alive during the entire process. Okay, for this fire gate, I went ahead and brought in igniter just so that I could get through, but you see that there's a bunch of trolls on top of the boxes. Uh, so what I went ahead and did was use my Zook, who is fully upgraded with the Merv Mortar upgrade. Um, so he is able to take out most of the ranged opponents uh, and be on the the ground floor here and still be able to attack all of them, which is really convenient for him.
Now once you've solved this little box puzzle and you've picked up the second hat, the little almost German war helmet, you've pretty much solved everything in this level. So just go through and get the uh, 636 time limit on it and you've got another three stars. So thanks for watching and we will see you next time.